Hello, friends. Today we want to talk about a very important and influential project in Afghanistan. This project, which has started working in Naglu Dam of Sarubi District of Kabul, aims to produce solar energy. In this video, we want to talk about the importance of this project, its costs, its review, and the future of energy production in Afghanistan. The construction work of the 10 megawatt solar energy production project worth six and a half million US dollars has started in Naglu Band. This project, funded by a private company, is one of the big steps towards reducing Afghanistan's dependence on energy imports. The opening ceremony of this project was held with the presence of high-ranking officials, and it was mentioned as a vital step in providing independent energy for the country. Abdul Ghani Baradar emphasized in this ceremony that this project will play a major role in reducing Afghanistan's need to import electricity from neighboring countries. He also mentioned other projects, such as the 500 kV line of Turkmenistan, which is still ongoing, and with its completion, Afghanistan will be able to transfer hundreds of megawatts of electricity imported from Turkmenistan to the country. This solar energy production project is important in two ways. First, reducing energy import costs, and second, increasing the use of domestic and renewable resources. Solar energy production is one of the main solutions for remote and low-power areas. While Afghanistan is facing the problem of energy supply, the use of solar energy is considered a very important opportunity. Officials of the Ministry of Energy and Water have announced that this project will initially produce 10 megawatts of electricity, and after that, the production of another 10 megawatts will begin in Tarakel area of Kabul. Overall, this project can play a key role in supplying energy to different regions. This project is being implemented by a private company with an investment of more than six and a half million U.S. dollars. Government officials have announced that this project will have many economic and social impacts after its launch. It is estimated that more than a thousand people will work in this project, and its direct and indirect effects will cover more than tens of thousands of people. This is a sign of the high importance of this project for the country's economy. From an economic point of view, investing in such projects is evaluated very positively. Domestic energy supply not only reduces import costs, but also makes Afghanistan a self-sufficient country in the field of energy. For this reason, the officials of the Islamic Emirate and the Ministry of Energy and Water have announced that this project is one of their main priorities. Currently, Afghanistan has only about 960 megawatts of electricity, part of which is imported. According to Breshna company officials, around 350 to 400 megawatts of electricity is supplied from domestic sources. This amount is not enough at all, because Afghanistan needs at least 5,000 megawatts of electricity. This issue indicates that more projects should be implemented to fully meet the country's electricity needs. Officials of Breshna Company have announced that Afghanistan has a very high capacity in producing energy from various sources, including solar, wind, thermal, and water. For example, the country has the capacity to produce 222,000 megawatts of solar electricity, which can make Afghanistan a major energy producer in the near future. However, there are still many challenges. The most important challenge is the need for large investments and time. The government of the Islamic Emirate has emphasized that in order to achieve self-sufficiency in energy production, we need to attract foreign investments and develop infrastructure. Other projects are also underway. For example, Naglu Dam, Kajaki Dam, and 500 kV power transmission projects are among the key projects that will increase Afghanistan's electricity capacity significantly. According to officials, so far, about 60 to 70 percent of the 500 kV line project, which transfers electricity from the northern regions of the country to Kabul and then to the south, has been completed. On the other hand, various countries including Turkey, China, and Iran are interested in investing in energy production in Afghanistan. This is a sign of the high potential of the country to attract investment in the field of energy. This solar energy production project in Naglu Dam is a very important step towards Afghanistan's self-sufficiency in the field of energy. But many challenges remain. Although these projects will significantly contribute to the energy supply, 
Afghanistan still needs more investments, international cooperation, and infrastructure development. Solar electricity is one of the key solutions for Afghanistan's future, and considering the country's rich solar resources, this type of energy can become one of the main sources of electricity supply. Along with these projects, the Islamic Emirate should also start more projects in different regions of the country to provide access to electricity for all Afghan citizens. Along with the progress of the solar power generation project in Naglu Dam, this project is part of a wider program to increase the production of energy from renewable sources in Afghanistan. While Ban Naglu specifically focuses on generating electricity from solar energy, these projects help Afghanistan achieve its larger goal of reducing dependence on imported electricity and strengthening energy independence. The use of solar energy will be very critical, especially in mountainous and remote areas where access to other sources of electricity is difficult. Also, these projects have positive effects on reducing environmental pollution. Afghanistan, which is facing environmental challenges and climate changes, can make a significant contribution to reducing greenhouse gas emissions by using clean energy such as solar energy. Increasing solar projects will not only help provide electricity to cities and villages, but can also boost local economies by creating new job opportunities for young people in the renewable energy sector. Considering that Afghanistan has a very high capacity to produce solar energy, the government and the private sector should fully utilize this capacity. Implementation of more projects similar to the Naglu project in other regions of the country can help solve electricity problems and be a sustainable way to provide energy in the future of Afghanistan. This was our report on the solar energy production project in Bandi Naglu. We hope that this project will be successful and help the people of Afghanistan to have a brighter and more energetic future. Thank you for watching.